Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to do a little quick tip on how to delete diagnostic data in Windows 10. If you didn't know, the diagnostic data collects data from Microsoft to improve the operating system, Windows 10, and to fix problems which you probably run into in the troubleshooter. So when you have a problem, it gathers that data and helps other people fix problems. If you want to shut it off, you can, and you can delete the data. So go ahead and click on your start. And then we're going to click Settings. Once your settings page is up, look for privacy right here. And over to the right, we have diagnostics and feedback. Now, before we get down to deleting the diagnostic data, as you cruise by, don't forget to stop right here. Optional diagnostic data. This sends data back and forth about websites you browse, how you use apps and features, device health, everything it shows you right here. Go ahead and click that off if you like. And let's cruise on down. I also disconnect tailored experiences, that's just me. Here's your view diagnostic data and here's your delete. So there's a couple things to look at here. Deleting, just simply click on the delete button and it clears it out. Now, if you want to view the diagnostic data, which if I'm being honest with you, there's really no point in it, but just if you do, there's a downside. You have to turn it on first, then open diagnostic data viewer. If you do not have it, you have to go to the Windows Store and get it. Personally, I've never used it because I prefer to just simply click delete. And there you have it. Today's simple little quick tip on how to delete diagnostic data in Windows 10. Bottom right corner of the Major Geeks logo should pop up. If you click on that, you can subscribe. We'd appreciate that. And we appreciate you watching as always. See ya.